thought after the game, after looking at the film, uh, you know, we looked nervous and tight on both sides the first half. And uh, we didn't loosen up much until about midway through the third quarter. Uh, we can play much better than what we played the first two quarters and a half and pretty much showed it the second half. But uh, uh, defensively, you know, I thought it was more of Texas State than it was us and what they were doing, how they were doing it, some, some stuff we hadn't had a chance to work on with a young team. Uh, we only missed four or five tackles, which was good out of 70 plays. Uh, we had some good performances, guys that played hard. Dartwan Bush, obviously, key, making them turn the ball over for a couple of times and uh, getting us out of a, a jam. But uh, losing Cody and Dewhurst coming in, uh, I thought he did a good job. Uh, but uh, overall, you know, rate our defense about a B minus, high C. Uh, we're going to have to play much better, but we did play a lot of guys. Oh, we did some good things. Dartwan Bush had a lot of production. Uh, he missed a couple of slants, but shoot, he forced two fumbles and he batted a couple of balls, and he was our player of the game uh, on defense with it. I thought we played really extremely hard, again, going back and watching the film. And, and good things started to happen to us the harder and the longer we played with it. And I think a lot of those turnovers that were, cr were created was because of how hard we went and played. Well, the biggest thing was going and getting lined up to all the tackle over stuff and everything, some of those different formations that we hadn't seen a lot. And, and like I said, once the second half rolled around, our kids really handled that well, and, and they picked up to the pace of the game with all of it really after about the second series out there. I think we had 20 plays in the first two series of 77 total that we had in the football game. Obviously, we're, we're not a finished product by any means. You all can tell that after watching us uh, on Saturday night. So what we did today was we worked a ton of young guys, a lot of the red shirt guys, a lot of the guys that, that in a, initially we had plans to get a lot of work on Saturday night that didn't just because of the way the game played out. Um, we got them a lot of work today. Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday are going to be a lot of work for veterans. Uh, offensively, we probably won't get into New Mexico until, uh, until Sunday. But uh, we've, got, we've got a lot of work to get done. You know, and, and like I said, we're, just, we're, trying, we're trying to find the best combinations. You know, it took us last year you know, we, we, I think it was week five, we moved Detron, switched Detron and Torres, and that kind of set us, set us up for a stretch run. We played pretty well uh, every game except after we made that move, except for the Oklahoma second half. And uh, we're just trying to find the best guys and get them in the right spots. So, and you, and you never know, because practice it's hard to tell, you never know until you actually play games.